What's going on guys? We're back for another GT Sport drift video. Now is it is a drift setup video. Now it's not no ordinary drift setup video. It's the vehicle in question is the Samba bus. I, I got a comment about a few years ago. I didn't say a few years ago, but a, a decent amount of time. Saying to do a drift setup on the video. And I said I would try it. I low key forgot about it until I got a message on that same video. And I read it. And then I had it on. Uh, I saw the comment again. So I remembered. But I was putting it off because. Uh, this is. The hardest drift video I'm going to ever do in my life. I'm going to tell that right straight up. This is going to be hard as fuck. But who knows? Might, might pull this off or might not. So. I'm just going to go straight on into it. I'm going to make it as light as possible. And the most power as possible. So, not even 100 horsepower. Uh, automatically going to comfort hard. It's, it's not even a question here. I'm gonna do that for thing. I'm, I'm actually gonna slam the bitch. Okay. Slam the bitch. Put zero on the, on the, on the, on the, uh, good old toe angle. Okay, that might change. Automatically going 60-60. It's a given. Okay. Get rid of the stock transmission. I'm gonna go... Uh, 75... I'm gonna go 81. I'm gonna go 81 on trans. Right off the hit. Okay. Right off the hit. I'm gonna do all that. Let's see if it, uh... Helps. Onto the track. Alright, I picked the track. I know it says Suzuka, but this is not Suzuka East, it's the full circuit. I have a plan here. Alright, got a plan here. Once again, all that is still the same. Alright. But I'm gonna go to a special location on this track. Alright, here's the section. Alright. Ah, oh, fuck it, Alright. Alright, there's a section. The parking lot. Now, I have to be in first person because that's all we can see out of this bitch. I don't drift in first person. I'm just gonna put that out there. So, here we go. Let's see how this goes. Just back and forth. Okay. I know this is a cop out. But I don't give a fuck. Do something like OSW shit. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't think any smoke came out. I felt like it was going pretty sideways. But, I don't think any smoke came out. Try that again here. I mean, it is, it is drift, oh, just a drift tap right there. Drift anything. I feel like I'm going pretty sideways.
Holy shit. There's no shot on Tandem in the sequel. There's no shot. Because there won't be an online portion. I'm, I'm, I won't drive this online. I don't care if it's for a video or not. I'm not beating that person. Tune this up a little bit. Standing in foot. Holy shit. Not bad, not bad. Going off to the, off to the replays. So I like doing. All right. Here's here's the replay. Let me go. Off to the races. Squaw on this bad boy. Try to fling it in there. I'm gonna do this in third person because the uh, the replay cameras on the section suck ass. Oh, that was so smoke! That was so smoke! So smoke! Me really trying hard, guys. I'm trying my best. It's not the easiest thing in the world. It's the hardest thing to do. It still weighs 2,000 pounds. Just it sounds light, but if we only have um, 90 horsepower, it isn't enough. I, I really need about buck 20, buck 25 on this to really get this thing going. Maybe a buck fifty, maybe two hundred. Two hundred would probably be overkill. Doing a horse. Probably be overkill for the tires. And swap a fucking Porsche motor. And be fine. Like a turbo. Look at this, like a turbo motor from the Porsche. It'd be just fine. But you see the struggles. You see the struggles. Oh, the bargain. Oh, the bargain. I'm trying, man. I'm trying. That's enough of that. Enough of that. Let's see if we can get a car going throughout the section here. That's my goal for this episode here. I slammed it, like I said. 
I'm actually gonna do one of these numbers. Want it as loose as possible. Loose as possible. Right? Very stiff. I still don't want rear camber. That's the thing. As, and a little bit from camber. I'm actually going to go out on the toe. I never do this. This is the only exception. And uh, I'm gonna, I'm a little bit up on trans. A little bit up on trans. The car can go faster. All right. Back onto the section. All right. Back on the section here. See how this goes, guys. User error right there. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm cheating. I'm cheating a little bit. You're off line, off the racing track. It's a lot more slick. It's a lot more slick. So I'm, I'm kind of cheating. I don't give a fuck. Sorry for not talking, I'm just concentrating. One more time here. I need more horsepower. Oh, I need more horsepower. This would be so fun if it had a little bit more horsepower. This is a small section, I know. So, this is not good. There we go. Momentum speed and momentum is the key to victory. It could be looser though. I don't want to go down the route of maxing out the, the rear camera because I don't want to do that. That's, that's a little cop out. It's not realistic. Man, I'm a, I'm a function guy. I'm a fun, big function guy. Right? Big function guy. Come on, don't stall, don't stall. I might. I might, uh. I might go. I'm gonna watch the replay. We're gonna watch the replay real quick. And then see. What we can do. To make it. Hold the slide out and continue the slide. All right. I will not be defeated. All right. Okay. Back to the replay. You know. I messed up there. I'm gonna leave that in just because. Oh fuck! Right of the top. I forgot about the replay cameras being a little buggy over here. 
Right, it does get it does get sideways, right? But I think it should get sideways a little bit more than what it actually is doing. I mean, this should be loose because it's all it's as um hard as like the suspension is really stiff. Right? This is really stiff, so it should be as loose as loose as possible, but it is a skid pad. So I guess that was a little bit. I'm I'm trying the best, the best I can. Hope you guys enjoy it. Hope you guys enjoying this video so far. This is really difficult. Have it function, but slide good. That's the that's the, that's my goal here. Again, I have, to, I have to really. So I'm using my wheel, so it makes it even harder. Right? If it was I'm on controller, it'd be a little bit easier. But this setup should work for controller if you want. If you want to, the wheel that I'm using, right, is a T300 GT edition with the three pedal set. And I got a, I got the shifter along with it. Um, TPA, I don't know, TPA Pro pedals in uh, TAH shifter so even though I have it fully customizable on stay I'm still using the shifter so I don't have to use the the paddles that's the only it's a good thing about uh entries most support they added that use the shifter it doesn't matter what gearbox you have And I also got a Will Stand Pro. Non-sponsored, by the way. I'm just showing, I'm just telling you guys what my setup is actually is. All right. All right. See, see what can we do here. I think I think it's too late. I'm just gonna max this motherfucker out. See what this does. So, the front is alright. I'm gonna lower the front camber just a tad. Alright. But, there's nothing I could do otherwise to make it uh, as stiff as. I need it as stiff as possible so it'll be as slippery as possible. You understand? Know Gearbox is fine. Uh, there's nothing else I could really do to make it as slight as possible with the worst power guys. You know what I'm saying? But we're going to get to the section. Here we go, guys. Alright, guys. Last attempt. Because I don't know what else to do. So, here we go. Took all the grip I could possibly take out of the rear on suspension side. So, let's go. The best chance possible with a small section, you know, smet a, a, a section on a skid pad off the track, which means it's dirty and it's, and it's really slick. Really slick in general. So even if it's on on time trial like it is, it, it, you still get it's still loose. So let's just get on into it. Go. Ah, right, nice speed. Oh, here we go. Ah, 
ist Lust aus. Decent, decent rotation. Since I don't have a proper handbrake yet, I don't say yet, because it's never is say never. You know? Anyways, <clears throat> probably lost like 50 subscribers doing that, but you know. <laughs> All right, here we go. Rapid fire. It's not, this is not drifting, guys. I'm not drifting. It's, it's sliding. I'm sliding right now. I'm not drifting. It's a sliding episode. That's all I'm doing. It's not drifting. I'm not, I'm not drifting. It's sliding. Should I go for a tail tap right there. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of work. Especially for the cars um, that I'm used to. Alright. So I'm, right now I'm used to 2020 Supra and a Ford Mustang. Right. The Ford the GT Mustang. Like, would, would I recommend this car? Hell no. I'm gonna be trolling. You can go for it. All right. Would it get some skids down? Yeah. Will you be a pain in the ass? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Because if I'm struggling, you guys are going to struggle. I mean, I could... I could cop out and put Max Camber on it. So it would actually slide, but that's not my style, you know. That's a cop out. This is a challenge right here. Alright, I'm gonna try to I'm going for a tail tap on that wall there. Slow down right there a lot. Ah, damn it. I didn't get it. I didn't get that thumbnail. Second. 
Yeah! You got it! Hell yeah. I'm, f I'm fucking sweating ass. Man. Okay, one more run here. Not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. Not bad. Alright, here we go. You know, I said the last one was the last one. You know, you always gotta do that one more, right? I mean, transitions and slow speed is not bad. It's not bad. You need to. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. Not bad at all. Victory donuts. The hardest. The hardest corn I ever. on this series. And yeah, I managed to pull it off. Somewhat. Not really. This is the hardest drift car you'll ever try to slide. I say drift, but. it's slide. Let's go to the replay now. All right. See, I, I really, I'm really trying to whip that shit in. It just doesn't do it, you know. But look at that. Okay, okay. God damn it. Thought we we're gonna get age restricted for the <laughs> fucking. The side of it. You guys get the picture. This is uh, interesting, to say the least, man. Interesting to say the least, man. Sorry, right, I'm getting distracted. <coughs> Corona. Getting distracted on, on the back of that. Alright. Once again. Get the most momentum as possible and fucking yank that bitch. Look at that angle, baby. You have to be the elite of the elite to drive this thing. Elite of the elite. Because Especially if you put my tune on it, you know what I'm saying? Because even if I'm trying to go non-grip, I still have too much grip, you know? Yeah, that's why I want to try to go for the tail tap in it. I didn't want to have any wheel spin on it, you know what I'm saying? Hard 
like trying to do. Bro, my shoulders are fucking torn. From moving this shit back and forth. Skip it to the oh, if you guys enjoy this video, like, share, and subscribe, and let me know what next car I should do on the channel for the drift setup. I, I will call it drift build, but I, I can't because you're not building the car, you just, um, you know, it's not called the drift setup. You're setting up the car, you're not building the car. The car is already that power already, you know what I'm saying? So, if you guys st like and really enjoyed it, me struggling, like, share, subscribe, and uh, once again, uh, peace, peace out.